Hello everyone, welcome back here at La Arnie's Kitchen and Food Creations. Tonight I would like to share with you on how to make mango salsa. So originally the word salsa is sauce uh, from the Latin America. And so we're glad they passed that on to us and to some other uh, nationalities and we adapted them. <laughs> so that will be paired with my corn chips. So this one, so this salsa, this will be a dipping sauce and this is uh, corn chips. So what are the very basic ingredients? So I slice green crunchy mangoes. So these are um, green mangoes and they're very crunchy. It's not ripe, but the color is yellow. So I slice them into tiny cubes and also finely chopped red onions and roma tomato i use roma tomatoes because they're very nice and firm and i'm going to squeeze some lime i love to have some lime in this salsa than the lemon <laughs> it goes with the lime but however if you don't have lime you can use this yellow lemon okay or lemoncito I'm going to add some, a little bit of maybe two tablespoons of brown sugar, or you can use white sugar. I have here fresh cilantro and I chopped it, this one. So basically how many ingredients that we have? One, two, three, four, five ingredients. And our seasoning, a flavor enhancer will be just the brown sugar and the sea salt. I like to use the sea salt, okay? So I have here my mixing bowl and this will be my serving platter later. Okay, what I'm going to do is I would like to combine everything, all the wonderful ingredients. So make sure you wash your um, greens, your veggies or all the ingredients thoroughly. Okay, wonderful friends, here are the very basic ingredients that we have. Tomatoes, chopped cilantro or coriander. And these are red onions and the mangoes. We we'll just add the brown sugar and the salt. So adding salt depends upon your taste buds as well. So we would just uh, mix this all together, lovely. <laughs> and then I'll have to squeeze some lime. Okay, there you go, folks. So I'm just going to add this. I mean, I'm just going to mix this thoroughly until all the ingredients are well combined you can also add some pineapple tea bits or pineapple crushed and a little bit of cucumbers would be good so this is good to go So I'm going to arrange my chips here. Okay, there you go. So I'll have to add my um, homemade 